Welcome back to the channel. Today we're in Siem Reap, Cambodia, and we're gonna take you around and show you what it's really like. Shay is relaxing at the pool, and I'm on a mission to go to the store and get some supplies for tomorrow, because we're doing a 10-hour tour of Anchor Watt. And we wanna thank everybody for the awesome feedback on our latest video, I'll link it here just talking about why we make these videos. We make these videos to document what it's actually like to travel around the world, and we're gonna keep doing that. And this is our fifth country on our trip around the world, Cambodia. This looks to be like one of the main streets in Siem Reap. It's a lot different from the big city Phnom Penh that we were just in. It's currently 40 degrees still, and just walk into the store. Okay, I'm still walking on the road, the same road I was on. To be honest, there's not much to see or do here. I'm looking for an actual store, something that has air conditioning so I can look around because so far they're just little stores in their houses, I think. So we're gonna keep looking. Good news, found the store. We're after coffee, water, and breakfast tomorrow because we're getting up at 3 a.m. to go see Anchor Watt. Okay, picked up some stuff from the store. Got some Tylenol because we haven't seen it for a while. That was a dollar fifty U.S. dollar fifty. Got some, got four little shots of espresso for tomorrow and a beer because it was only seventy cents. And now we're gonna go back and check on Shay. I was at the pool while David went for a walk, and it is hot out. The pool's water is warm, so it's not even refreshing to go swimming. And now we're back in the room to stay cold. We're going to Pub Street today, which is where they have bugs here in Cambodia, and I'm super excited to see if David will eat a bug. Maybe a tarantula or a scorpion. It's a frog. We found a frog. Watch that cereal. Oh my gosh. I'm some food that aren't bugs, but we are going to try and find the bugs. Okay, we just walked the entire night market. There was no tarantulas and scorpions as advertised. So now we're going to go to the Riverside Market and see what we can eat for dinner. <laughs> this is scary. I am terrified. We're on a mission. So weirdest thing in my life, I've never gone up to people with a picture of someone eating a tarantula and asked where can we do it. But they said across the street and it's kind of sad. It's a seems to be a really poor country because they keep coming up to us asking, like they're desperate for our business, uh, asking us to eat with them and buy their food and stuff. But we're yeah. still on the hunt for tarantulas. Hopefully they and, have it all. And real dinner. Yeah. Ridiculous. We when, can't find it anywhere. When we're not looking for it, we found it. Like in Laos, we found disgusting silkworms. In Thailand, we found bugs. But we were new to traveling, so there's no way we were going to do that. And now we're walking around, and there isn't a bug in sight. Well, we couldn't find any bugs, but I did find rice and a pineapple. So that's what I'm eating for dinner. We had such a disappointing night. We didn't find any bugs anywhere. Which I know should be a positive, but here when you're trying to eat them, it actually is a negative. We can't find any. We're back in a tuk-tuk, five minute drive to a hotel, and then we'll see you in a few hours because we're getting up at 3 a.m. to go to Anchor Wat. For sunrise. 